In ancient times, different communities used different tools for measuring capacities and volumes. So, there was no common tool to be used by everyone. They used common objects, such as jars and pots, to measure volumes and capacity. Gradually, mankind noticed that there must be a unique system for measurements to be used worldwide. What are volume and capacity? Look at the following bottles. They all look different. They have different shapes, different heights, different colors, and different liquids inside. But they have one common property. The amounts of liquids inside the bottles are the same. Each bottle holds two liters of a liquid. So, we see that all the bottles have a common property. This property is the amount of space they have for holding a liquid. This space is called capacity. So, we can say that all these bottles have the same capacity. Sometimes, the amounts of liquids inside different bottles or jars are the same, but the capacities of the containers are not the same. The following cylinders, which all have different capacities, but the amounts of liquids inside all the cylinders are the same. This amount is called volume. Volume represents the amount of a liquid or how much space the liquid takes up in a container. Let's see what you have learned in this lesson.